Robin Brown's ex, David Jessup's sad cancer battle update, and fans point finger at Cody Brown trying to smear Mary's new man. Also Cody Brown crying out for help, admits Robin is scheming. Also Mary Brown says, true friends make you ride the bull. Hey lovely viewers, welcome to my 2S gossip channel. Sister Wives star Robin Brown's ex-husband, David Jessup, has been battling cancer for quite some time. The 45-year-old remains silent regarding her ex's condition. Luckily, David's sister-in-law, Stacy, has kept the fans updated about his status. Recently, Stacy shared big updates about her brother-in-law, and it seems that things are not looking good. David is currently battling chronic myeloid leukemia. It's a type of slowly progressing blood cell cancer of the bone marrow that usually occurs during or after middle age and rarely occurs in children. David has been battling cancer for over a year. According to Stacy, her brother-in-law has been positive throughout his journey, but it seems things are only getting more difficult for him. Stacy recently posted an update on David's GoFundMe page. According to her, she's been receiving a lot of messages asking for an update about her brother-in-law. She revealed that things have been difficult over the past few months for them and added that they've been having problems with David's insurance. Still waiting after all this time to hear back if the renewal has gone through and haven't heard a word, she added. Stacy also said that David's chemo pills are starting to run out, and it would be a deadly situation for him. Without insurance to cover the cost there's no way we could afford the meds he needs, she added. Furthermore, Stacy mentioned that David has been suffering from excruciating pain from the side effects of his medicines. But it's the only way to keep his numbers where they should be. After that, the sister-in-law thanked everyone who's been donating. And praying for David. I'm happy he tries keeping positive but also thought it's worth explaining this side as well so people know how to pray or help where they can. We are beyond grateful to all those who've prayed, donated, reached out etc., she added. There have been speculations that Robin refused to tell her older kids that their dad has cancer. The two are parents to Dayton, Aurora, and Brianna. It was also reported that David was ordered to pay child support for his three kids. However, David is now the one in deep need, and it's unclear if Robin and her adult children have done anything to help him. But with the kids' access to the internet today, many believe that they're now aware of their father's condition. There are also rumors that Dayton spent the holidays with his biological dad in 2022. Recently, after Mary Brown announced her new boyfriend to the world, news broke about his past. However, Sister Wives fans are pointing the finger at Cody Brown for publicly trying to smear Mary's new man. Fans believe Cody Brown is trying to smear Amos. Earlier this week, Mary Brown gave Sister Wives fans a gift for her birthday. She introduced fans to her new boyfriend, Amos. But ever since, news has swirled with details unearthed about her new beau. In particular, In Touch released an article that fans are saying, outs Mary's new man. But after the release, fans are speculating that Cody Brown was behind the smear tactic. Within a Reddit feed, Sister Wives points out how In Touch, outs, Mary, but more so discusses who they believe gave the information to the outlet. First, a user opens the conversation by saying, who wants to guess, who did this thinking face? Afterward adding a screenshot of the article, Money Woes. Sister Wives, star Mary Brown's new man Amos Andrews previously filed for bankruptcy. Then fans joined in with their thoughts. This is so disgusting. She didn't give his full name or tag him. His life shouldn't be picked apart like this. One user mentions Mary didn't give Amos's last name, but someone else rebuttals. She did. You can very much tell he was well prepped for the public outing, however. He changed up his whole public profile before going public. He seemed to be prepared to answer questions about his wife and such. He was prepared to go public. I feel bad because I don't think Amos is ready for, or desires, the public scrutiny he's about to experience. Then. Someone begins to point to Cody Brown, it's not the tabloids destroying these women. It's the person getting the information from producers and leaking it to certain rags for money and to punish his property for leaving him. Furthermore, Sister Wives fans discuss the dirt found on Amos that they claim Cody Brown is behind. 
Then speaking about Cody Brown, someone says, from what I understand he believes Sister Wives is, his, show. He wants to see all films whether it's used, or not to see what people are saying about him and to see what the kids and the exes are doing. In their religion these women are his property, and he has the perfect way of watching everyone is by what is filmed. We sure don't want to see Cody have a tantrum and the show is a cash cow right now. Keep Cody happy, everyone is happy. He never thought these women would leave him. He has one married and one dating. His delusions of the family coming back together and all the kids except. Leon coming to Coyote's piss to live to not going to happen. His property has left him and they took his money. Additionally, Sister Wives fans also talked about the Brown family having many financial woes of their own. Notably, users point out that while Cody Brown didn't necessarily file bankruptcy, most of his wives have. And several people join with different areas that have admissions of financial struggle. Some fans aren't sure it was Cody Brown. While not everyone on Reddit is sure that Cody Brown is orchestrating the smear tactics, some Sister Wives fans are pleading with Mary to proceed with caution. Although most were willing to let the bankruptcy slide, one person points out another doozy from Amos's past. I saw another article saying he had been divorced four times. That's more divorces than Cody has had. And someone else adds, that would worry me a lot more than an old bankruptcy. While fans continue to watch back some of the specials from the last season of Sister Wives, they also seem to keep finding new hidden jewels. During an episode, the patriarch, Cody Brown, seemingly comes to the realization Robin Brown is manipulating him. In response, many fans are talking about how he appears to be crying out for help while she is scheming. Fans catch concerning detail from Cody Brown. Although all of the Brown relationships have been a bit rocky over the past season, fans caught a detail in the tell-all specials that have them. Wondering about Cody, while watching back episodes, Sister Wives fans are talking about a clue that Cody Brown is crying out for help. Within a Reddit discussion, a user opens, Cody admits Robin manipulates him, then they post pictures of Cody reflecting on his relationship. Additionally adding, so, I rewatched because many are saying Mary said Robin was involved in the fishing, she didn't, but this is what really caught my eye, Cody is saying it's normal for a wife to be. Machiavellian. To her husband, following the introduction of the topic on Reddit, fans added their thoughts about Cody Brown using the term, Machiavellian, to describe his wives. I hate when he uses words he doesn't understand. It's like he got a word of the day calendar and only ever paid attention to the word and the date. It's a pretty succinct way to describe he and Robin honestly. And God knows narcissists love to project. Just a quick Google would help him out. Machiavellians are sly, deceptive, distrusting, and manipulative. They are characterized by cynical and misanthropic beliefs, callousness, a striving for money, power, and status, and the use of cunning influence tactics. Lol, exactly and why does he think being deceitful and distrusting is normal in any marriage? I mean according to him he spent nearly 20 years married to three women he never loved, and only understood what marriage, really is when he met Robin. So yeah, to which someone adds. Lol good point. But another person says, maybe he is crying out for help. Someone else wonders about Cody Brown saying, he already said in one of the sit downs that he wanted to change his name and give up and move away. I was assuming alone. Did anyone see that episode? Additionally, more Sister Wives fans chime in on Reddit about Cody Brown's statements. Definition perfectly illustrates Robin's behavior. Isn't that strange, s? How are you certain that he doesn't understand the meaning of the word? One fan answers, just based on the plethora of other words he frequently misuses on the show, but yeah he absolutely could actually get this one and just be projecting. Exactly, I was actually shocked he used a word which so perfectly describes Sabin. These types of statements by him and the post being made are so frustrating. There is no context to his statement. No follow-up questions of to what he means by that statement. And to be fair, I don't like this line of questioning or editing or think it's okay for any cast member. Any statement can be taken out of context. While Sister Wives Mary Brown stole back the spotlight this week following Christine Brown and David Woolley's wedding, 
she continues to shine throughout the week. Although fans have been celebrating with Christine heading into a new life chapter, now fans rejoice with Mary and Amos publicly kicking off their journey. Mary Brown airs her secret. Throughout the week, Mary Brown has been showing her newest fashion accessory, a new man. Rather politely, Mary sat on her secret until Christine Brown and David Woolley wrapped up their second part of the Sister Wives wedding special. However, just days later she gave fans a juicy birthday reveal that she and Amos are an item. After Mary's big announcement, Jen Sullivan jumps in the comments to say, I just popped on to see if you announced yet. Yay, enjoy your birthday, dinner with your really great guy. Hi Amos, ready or not. Additionally, she was met with lots of other comments. Dang all of you sister wives upgraded. Should have dropped Cody a decade ago. Happiness looks much better on you. Mary and Christine have both found men who are confident to rock a bald head I'm so happy for you to finally find happiness. Along with her birthday surprise, Mary Brown was tagged on Instagram with a list of fun birthday ideas to ring in her 53. Birthday. First on the list was, a, birthday dinner date with a great guy. Admittedly, these were suggestions that Jen Sullivan consolidated for her to pick from. Okay at Theriel Mara Brown make a wish. Here are ideas based off comments, messages, and recent conversations. What'll it be? But number one seems to fit right in with her newly announced relationship. And number six, exciting announcements, also seems to be a big part of her birthday week as well. Additionally, Mary, Brown seems to be celebrating the week away with her closest friends as well. In particular, she posts on her Instagram stories a playful video with her enjoying every minute of her birthday she can. Within the video, she saddles up for dinner and has overlaid text saying, Yeehaw! True friends make you ride the bull on your b-day. Following, yes, yes they do. And you see her dancing and yelling while the Texas Roadhouse waitress announces Mary's 21st birthday. Undoubtedly, she is embracing the moment even though it may have been slightly embarrassing. Then around her, her friends cheer her on as she adds some shoulder shimmies to her dancing. Undeniably, Mary is enjoying life more with a supportive group of friends pushing her to do things outside her comfort zone. What do you think about this video please told on comment box also subscribe our channel. Thanks for watching this video.